And now, viewers, CRZ Y presents the return of Miss Leah Flynn part in production. The Return of Miss Lee Having once again merged with the primordial cosmic ooze from which she sprang forth eons ago, Miss Lee reemerged about a thousand years later. She was visibly enhanced and spiritually strengthened, and her eyes radiated the primal essence with which she had joined during her merge. Miss Lee's essence was now more refined than her original substance. She exemplified the dictum that all residue returns to essence prior to its resurgence. In form, she remained virtually unchanged, but in pure essence she had been substantially altered. Miss Lee first encountered the Pedna twins after her conflict with Foon the Unlimited. At this time, the marriage between Piddly Deer and Foon had become somewhat of a sensation after the untimely birth of their tiny daughter, Fiddlewea. It was only through the beneficent and generous intercession of Miss Lee that the Padna twins were spared the fate of the ten and nine birds. Miss Lee would neither touch nor eat roast duck because she admitted I am constitutionally and irrevocably predisposed to the strictest and most rigorous vegetarianism. She would later point out, In a previous life, I was an offensive little bird whom a cruel hunter shot through with a small arrow and thereafter proceeded to cook me over a hastily built open fire. When asked what her ultimate purpose was in reasserting herself in secondary existences, she replied, it is both my goal and my aim to reunite time and space in such a way as to merge consummate reality with idealistic presupposition and thus rend objective manifestations senseless, having disrupted the balance of what is, what is not, what shall be, and what never was. Miss Lee is believed to have begotten a tiny daughter who disappeared, it is believed, at the age of five and became a female warrior. <laughs>